hello, happy Friday, or whatever day you happen to be watching this video. This week's topic is friendship. Don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> this week's topic is friendship and Yeah, so I haven't really planned what I'm going to say for this video, so sorry if it's a little weird, but I guess I don't know what everyone else talked about either this week, so uh, yeah, just winging it. I guess just for me, friendship is such an open topic, isn't it? Uh, I guess for me... In recent years, friendship has been a little bit difficult for me. And to be honest, friendship's always been a little bit difficult for me. I don't really have many of the same friends I used to, and I think that's pretty normal. But, you know, sometimes I'm on Facebook and stuff, and I see people who... My hair is dripping. Oh, I'm sorry. People who were friends in high school still hanging out and stuff, and... In all fairness, I did move like halfway across the country from where I went to high school, but yeah, I just don't, I don't have that same experience. Even when I was in high school, I didn't really go over to friends' houses or, or spend a lot of time with a lot of people. I had a few friends here and there, um, but yeah, I just, I, I don't really have a lot of friends, I guess, uh, which isn't a bad thing. Sometimes it's better to, to have just a few really good friends. Uh, but definitely, like, about three years ago, I kind of had a falling out with my two best friends, uh, a really bad falling out that was just really messy and, and really just not good, and since then, I think it's been hard for me to really, well, on one hand, connect with my old friendships, but also go out and try to like form new friendships because that whole falling out was really kind of I mean traumatic not to use that word lightly uh, I do have uh, diagnosed PTSD and um, yeah it, it just it's been difficult so I think that's something I've been working on a lot with my counselor is just going out and trying to make these connections because been difficult since since then and even before then so it just kind of made it harder especially having like anxiety social anxiety really doesn't make those things any easier that being said I do have a good little group of friends uh, sometimes I wish that I could go more give more to my friends give more of myself or like like try to deepen those connections a little bit more because it's definitely different now than it was three years ago for me. Um, I used to be able to get a lot more connected to people and now I still kind of have like a wall up, which might be okay for now, but I'm hoping that, you know, through time and stuff, I can kind of uh, bring that wall down a little bit. I definitely have some good friends and, and um, I have about three or so people I talk to pretty regularly, three or four people, and then I have some people who um, I like video chat with and stuff. I recently just video chatted with a friend of mine who I hadn't talked to in a few, in a while, I don't know, maybe like a year or two years or so. Uh, we used to video chat and, and we kind of just a lot of things were going on they were like overseas and stuff but I recently video chatted with them for the first time in a while and it was really great we talked for a few hours and it was just like nothing had changed it was super awesome and it's super cool to like kind of be able to come back to that I've, I've definitely had like friends who I lost touch with and then they came back or like I did have another a different falling out around the same time I had the falling out maybe a little bit earlier than I had the falling out with those two best friends. I had a different falling out with a, another friend of mine and we didn't talk for a while and then he came back into my life and we kind of, uh, it took us a while, definitely. It was slow at first, but we're, we're kind of doing really well now and we kind of 
we're able to get a little bit back to where we were. Um, we video chat at times, and, and yeah, it's just it's 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 great, and it's 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 not anything like it's not anything like what I see in movies or television. Like that's not the experience I've really had with friendship. That's kind of the experience I had with my two friends that I had the bad falling out with. And that's, I think, one thing that was really cool about that friendship. And and, and one thing that was really difficult about losing that friendship is it, it's, it was the kind of friendships I had seen in movies and television and always thought of what friendship is and, and what I wanted. But uh, since then, you know, I found my own way with friendship. And I think friendship can look so many different ways and comparing it to obvi obviously comparing life in general to movies and television can be so misleading and I think I'm really getting into a, a comfortable spot in a more content spot with my friendships and I've really learned that having you know really good strong friendships um, is more important than having that friendship that kind of looks like the movies or television it's really about the kind of friendship that works for you and um for me, it's really uh, about having those friendships that you can have those falling outs and come back together. You can have, you can be yourself. You can um, not worry so much about losing those friendships or, you know, just like things like that. I, I, don't, I don't know. It's just, it's better. Like, even though it's not quite what I thought I wanted or needed, it's better than that. And it doesn't look like anything i'm not basing it on anything i'm not comparing it to television or movie friendships or the other people i see on facebook with their friends like it's what works for me and it's it's my friendships and that's kind of been something i've kind of had to figure out is right for me and not and and kind of not worry so much about trying to make those friendships happen like those friends those kind of friendships they just happen on their own you don't have to worry about um, and that's what I really like about about the friendships I have now. So yeah, I, I hope this video made a little bit of sense. I feel like I just kind of said things, but I feel like that with every video. I don't know, I just try to keep it real. And this was, honestly was just like, like off the cuff. Like I did not plan it. I just kind of talked about it. Uh, yeah, but I think in summary... I'm still working on on friendships and understanding friendships and forming friendships and really um, opening myself up to my friends and, and making those deeper connections with my friends. Um, I've had some friendships that ended very badly. I have people who are no longer in my life anymore or our friendship is nothing like it used to be. Um, and then I have people who came into my life. I have friendships that that kind of had falling out and came back stronger than ever or just as strong or we've worked ourselves back to a good place um so you know there's I don't think there's any real good rhyme or reason to friendship or what makes a strong friendship you know obviously there's things that make a strong friendship but what works as a friendship for you I think you can't really compare that to anything else you can't you can't really look at other people or movies or television and, and say that's what a friendship looks like it's it's personalized to you and your friends and that's cool and that's that's okay and the best friendships come from that not from not they just come naturally like they don't they don't need any of this comparison or me trying to make it this or make it that it just happens and that's what I've learned and and I'm really grateful for the people I have in my life now um, and I'm, I'm grateful that I can kind of like what's the word I I just no, like I can just not worry about my friendships like of course I care about my friends and I worry about my friends but the actual friendship I'm not worried about because it's so naturally strong um, and I I have faith that they will work out exactly the way they're, they're supposed to be and that's that's the best friendship that just kind of is so natural it's just there and um you kind of know it's gonna it's gonna be what it's supposed to be. I don't know what more to say than that. Um, so, anyways, that's my little uh, stream of consciousness on friendship, I guess.
I hope you all are doing well. As always, stay strong, stay safe, and stay you. Love you all. Talk to you soon.